This is Laura. She's my friend. I've known her for over two years now. We both attended South Texas College. She was in my communications course, and we were both part of a few student organizations. So we've done a few projects together. I've always enjoyed her company and her passion for film. It's good to see how much we've both progressed at this university. I've had a Laura for multiple classes this year, and I'm very fortunate for that. I've seen just how ambitious and dedicated she is. To be honest, she's helped me stay on track and focused with my own studies. And I can truly appreciate that. I can see how driven she is as an individual and how much I keep learning from her. So, she's asked me to be a part of her project in which she'll be interviewing me. And so, I've decided to go ahead and document that to capture how that experience would be collaborating together. Record me, right? You're mm -hmm. recording? Yeah, I'm recording. Okay. So, I'm going to talk to this thing, but what I, what I just told you. Okay. Yep. Okay. The real question is, why did Castro experience such a phenomena for a week? An experience with such a strong impact like this stays with you the rest of your life. In a National Geographic survey, it was reported that 36% of people have experienced seeing a UFO in their lifetime. Dang, that sounded good. That was like 20 seconds. What is this for? This is for, this is a voiceover for an interview that I had to do for my multimedia class. Multimedia storytelling. I think so. Do you think the volume for this it's, is good? It sounded Fine. better, yeah, it sounded a lot better. Okay. Oh, in that case, let me go back to waveform and I'll put another file and I can edit. This is almost finished. It's almost yeah. We're waiting. How long has this, has this taken? How many how many days? How many hours have you been working on this project? Well, the interview part took a day in less than an hour, probably. I already had the questions, so I was prepared. Um, the editing portion it took about. I don't know. Have we have we been here? For Four hours? Yeah. I would say probably four hours. I don't know how to edit. <laughs> a minute. We're down to a minute. But you're a, you're a, you're a film student or you're a mass um, comm student? Or... Oh, yes. I'm sorry. I'm a, mass, I'm a mass comm major with a concentration in broadcasting and a minor in film. Okay. So I have all three of the medias, TV, radio, and film. Although, I don't really care for newscast. Radio seems fun, though. I like film. Cool, that's what we're doing. Mm-hmm. So, yes. It's almost, it's, it's almost there. Yes, it's almost done. <laughs> Which means we have to take all the other posters that are past due and then put up new ones. And then in a couple of days, we do it again. How fun. That does sound like fun. I love putting up posters. Oh my gosh, it's done. So, <laughs> it just completed right now as we were talking. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, now I'm still gonna save this. I did yay, I'm pleased. Okay, I'm at what was the question? Just you know, know what what is a 
a college student like yourself. Okay, anyway. Da um, daily routine. So what yes, do you go through? I wake through? up, like I said, in the ass crack of dawn, like at 5. I specifically wake up at 5.49 because that's a head start to me. That's a head start to me to to get dressed, to wash my face, brush my teeth, to do all that jazz. And then... Um, Um, sorry, um, to do all that, and then I make sure I have everything in my backpack. I usually, I forgot my laptop once, so now I just don't take it out of my backpack, and I, I just charge it at school. Um, so yeah, and most, most days I work in the mornings, um, so I'll get to work, uh, here on campus around 8 with the bus, right, but then I walk, it takes me, like, less than five minutes to get to walk to my building and i clock in usually at like 8 15 8 20 depends because sometimes it's locked and then yeah and then i'm there usually till 12 and then i do my classes which end early because they're morning classes and then if i have homework or projects or my friends need help with their projects i'll stay after school um for the most part, I've been here usually after school till five, the latest, since on Mondays and Wednesdays, I would usually work one to five. So around 5.20 is when I leave campus, usually. What time is it right now? Oof. Right now it's 10, 10 19 p.m., bro. I don't want to be here. <laughs> We're still on, we're still on campus. We're still on campus. Um, I'm looking for the thing where you put your unlisted videos. 